Hey guys, it's me again. Um, I did so happen to forget to give a little bit of information about myself so you guys can get to know me a little bit better. Um, basically, I'm a man of all cultures, whatnot, but I have grown up in the South my whole life. Um, that's pretty much like me is South. In the morning, I am going to work. Uh, after I go to work, I'm going to go work out. Which I'm really, actually, I'm actually really working while I work out, because I'm cutting trees tomorrow. Um, me, I am, I am a bigger dude, so don't get me wrong there. I am up there almost 200 pounds. Um, oh, let's see. I go fishing and hunting quite a bit. I do all this extracurricular activities that really no man has done before because they don't get the chances to in life because going out and going fishing and experiencing life that is an amazing thing really like you just go out there you sit down and you be quiet and you watch nature it's it's a beautiful thing uh going out and hunting getting to see all the little critters run around and do all that other stuff and it, it's it's a really great thing to do and me i am also a vapor i am giving up tobacco products here pretty soon um i have been recently engaged to the love of my life and i am very very excited to get married to her I cannot wait to see her again. Uh, she's up in Nebraska right now, and I'm not going to give out the where she's at, but I know she's up in Nebraska with her family right now because that's where she needs to be. I do plan on moving with her uh, somewhere, wherever she wants to go, wherever she can get a job, somewhere else. But we do plan on having a great time together, and I hope to God that... We stay together for life. Um, I'm typically the person that does not want to mess up a relationship. I hate messing up in a relationship. People mess up in relationships and they're like, oh God, what did I do? Uh, that's been me the past few relationships that I've had before her. Uh, you could say I was a screw up um, because of all my partying and doing all my stupid stuff that I just would do um, but saying that I I was not prepared for this video really um, I just it, <laughs> it's a really tough tough world to live in today because you've got so much heartbreak and divorce and I hate to see that, especially if you have kids. Kids, you may not realize it, but you're affecting them more to have a divorce. I'm lucky because my parents have not had a divorce within the 27 years that they've been together. Uh, me, I am, I am younger. I, I, I do have the younger side to me. Uh, my brothers and my sister, they actually have uh, they have had a, a, a bad occurrence like that and I feel so sorry for them because they haven't really had the parents there all the time for them that they have actually needed um, but just to get a little just a little bit more information about me is uh, I'm a man of many cultures like me I vape I go out run I work out I I work I actually work for a living I don't do like many people and sit at a desk I will not sit at a desk I say if I'm gonna sit at a desk I'm just being a lazy bum because if I'm a lazy bum I'm not saying that you guys are lazy sitting around a computer all day me I'm the person that if I'm gonna get something done I'm gonna do it now I'm not gonna do it later I'm gonna do it now uh, 
if you guys want to hear anything about me, just give me a like, subscribe, and tell me what you want to know about me on the comment section so I can know what you would like to know about me so I have more information uh, to give out. Um, just, <laughs> I'm, uh, I'm also a godly guy. I will, I will say that. I have completely forgot to say that. Um, Lord have mercy on me for not telling people that. Um, I will tell you right now, um, if you are feeling down within your within your ways just sit down go to the bible or go to go to your go to your book or something uh meditate a little bit just sit down and reflect on what the one man has done for you he's putting he he's given you a good life to tell you honestly just to sit here and watch me he's given you an amazing life giving you perfect life like he's given me an amazing life because I've got a brand new phone right now I've got the Galaxy S7 uh, he's given me many many things that I haven't looked on me I race part time too I, and you can say I I do want to go out and I, I would like to race farm truck in my Camaro because I'm I'm running pretty hot. And I don't I don't know if I'll beat him, but I'd be pretty close. Uh, for all of those who don't know who that is, just look up Street Outlaws and you'll you'll understand who Farm Truck is. But he he's got a nasty truck. Um, basically, uh, what I was trying to say before was sit down and reflect on your life a little bit say am i down in the dumps really i mean yeah we all have those tough days we all have really tough days and if you have a tough day so what it's gonna get better it has for me i was in a bad rut then my fiance come along i am so excited for her to come along and to tell me that she still loves me after not seeing each other since seventh grade. I'm 20 years old right now. I'm turning 21 this year. Thank God for that. Because, <laughs> you know, me, well, I, I like to party. Um, just a little bit. Not too much. Not too hard. I have gotten too hard and never seems to work out too well for me and my friends. Because they always, always look at me and they're like, man, you're, you're kind of, you're too much for me. But, I mean, just sit down and pray to God. Say, thank you. Thank you for giving me this challenge in life. Everything will get better. Trust me on that. Like and subscribe. Tell me what you want to hear about me. Uh, tell me what you want, to, want me to talk about. Just give me some information that I can tell you guys. Because I, I want to do this more. See y'all later.